guys and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am finally doing my apartment tour. So let's go ahead and get started. So when you first walk in on the left side are these two double doors and there is just my washer and my dryer. Here is just a quick overview of my entire apartment. Let's go ahead and start in the kitchen. When you walk into my kitchen, the first thing you're gonna see is my pantry. On the top shelf is just where I keep uh, my protein and just some other supplements that I use for weight loss as well as a dairy supplement since I am lactose intolerant. On the second shelf is just where I keep my pasta, rice, um, some extra olive oil, and some taco shells. And right below that is where I keep all of my snacks and my seasoning and just sauces that I use to cook my meals. On this shelf, I just try to keep all of my canned goods and just my extra flour and sugar. And on the last shelf is just where I keep all of my baking supplies. Right next to my pantry is just where my fridge is. I definitely do love on this fridge where I have the water and ice dispenser. It's super convenient and I don't have to worry about buying a Brita or even buying water bottles since I do have this available. So let's go ahead and see what I have inside of my fridge. On the door, I just like to keep my butter and cheese. On the next shelf, I also usually just keep all of my bags of cheese. And then right below that, I do keep uh, just a bottle of wine, some sour cream, salsa, lemon juice, and some ranch. And at the bottom, I just keep a Coke bottle. On the top shelf, I just like to keep all of my Celsius. On the left side, I keep my carbonated and my non-carbonated separate. Also just have my milk, my coffee creamer, and some tea that I drink on a daily basis. On this shelf, I just have some canned pineapple in the back and I actually just made some chicken Alfredo. So to the left side, I just have some leftover Alfredo sauce that I made and right behind that is a carton of eggs. This shelf is usually where I keep all of my fresh fruit. So I just have some lemons, blackberries, and some green grapes. And right below that is where I keep all of my fresh produce. So I just have some tomatoes and some potatoes. To the right, I do have some electrolytes since I've been a little bit sick lately. In my first drawer is where I keep my spinach, my onion, some stir fry mix, as well as some cookies. And in my final drawer right now, I just have a bag of baby carrots. Go ahead and move on to the freezer. On the top, I just keep some ice cream and some freeze pops. Right below that is where I keep all of my meat. On the third shelf, I just keep my acai packets as well as some frozen bananas. And then right below that is just where I keep all of my frozen fruit. I think right now I have about four or five bags down there. On the door of my freezer is where I usually just keep my frozen vegetables. So at the top, I just have some frozen broccoli. Down below, I just have a three pepper onion blend, some stir fried vegetables, as well as some peas and carrots. To the left of my fridge is just where I keep all of my seasoning right behind that is just my blender also where I have these containers that I got from home goods I just have some flour cake flour brown sugar chia seeds and coconut I also got the labels from Michaels I was gonna go through my cabinets but I realized I just don't have a lot of stuff so on the outside of my stove I have this towel that says today's menu eat it or starve I think I got that from home goods <laughs> On top of my stove, I usually keep my tea kettle as well as this spoon thing that I got from Home Goods as well. To the left side, I have this marble container that I absolutely love from Target with all of my utensils. I believe I got those from Walmart. Then I just have my toaster in the corner. Finally, right next to the sink, I just keep my two soaps as well as this dish drying mat that I believe I got from Target. So right next to my kitchen is actually where I have my bar area. So at the bottom, I just have this speaker system that I got back in 2009 from my great grandmother. And I also kind of keep my tripod there sometimes. In my bar area right now, I just have some tequila and some vodka as well as this mixer that I believe I got from Home Goods. And the tray I believe is from the store at home. Right next to it, I just have this caddy that's also from Target. And right behind that, I actually have a painting that I made with one of my friends who went to like one of those painting with me classes. So I thought this was really cool um, in this area. Right in front of my painting is actually where I keep my Amazon Echo Dot. Right next to that, I just have my sugar, tea, and coffee that are also next to my Keurig. 
In the cabinet above my bar area, I like to keep all of my teas. I do absolutely love the tea on the right side, I think. Um, it was just a gift from last year from Ross. And then right below that, I do have all of my mugs. I try to keep them all just in this one place. And right next to that, I just keep some straws, my honey, and then if I have any K-cups, I keep them there as well. In the right cabinets, I just keep all of my mail, some CDs, and my wine glasses and shot glasses. Are we wrong? Are we right? In this corner, I have a frame that I got from Kirkland's. It already had the Adventures of Weights. Below that is where I keep Mowgli's food bowl as well as the water dispenser and the mat below it I believe I got from at home. Right next to that I do have this white cart that I got from Ikea and on here I just try to keep all of Mowgli's things. So on the top I just have his treats. The next one is just where I keep like his collar, leash, and some dog toys. And the one below that I keep just a few more bones and some treats. And right below the cart I actually have an extra dog bowl for when his sister comes over. So my side table is from Ikea. Um, the vase that I do have on top is from Z Gallery. I think it was on sale when I bought it. To the left, the gold coasters are from Z Gallery and the ones on the right are from Home Goods. And the basket I have underneath is from Target. So my couch is from Rooms To Go. The two pillows on the outside, I believe, are from Tuesday Morning. The ones on the inside, I believe, are from Home Goods. The blanket is from Home Goods as well. And I believe the cute little polar bear pillow is either from Target or from Tuesday Morning. And look at little Mowgli sleeping. My coffee table is also from Ikea. They were actually a set. The bowl I have on top, the gold bowl I believe is from At Home, and the three balls in it are from Z Gallery. Also underneath I just keep a few um, home decor books, and on top I have my tarot deck. In this corner I just keep Mowgli's crate, and on top I just have a dog bed that I keep out sometimes for him since he likes it. And to the left of that is where you'll see my TV stand, which is from Nebraska Furniture Mart. And as you can see, I do definitely have a lot of DVDs. I've been stocking up on them uh, for a few years now. The lights I have flickering are from Target. The two boxes on the right side are both from Michaels. I just keep um, some extra DVDs in there as well as just extra video games. And on the left side, I have this cute little Christmas tree that I got from Target. And the gift box, I wanna say is from Michaels as well. While I was filming this video, I also had on the movie Princess Switch. It's a Netflix movie. Next to my TV stand, I actually have my Christmas tree. The star ornament is from At Home. Actually, the tree is also from At Home as well as the ornament. So let's go ahead and move into my bathroom. On my counter, I usually have a burning candle, especially at night. And right behind it, I actually have this tray that I believe I got from Target. In the first drawer is where I keep just my daily essentials. So my brush, my face moisturizer, also have some makeup in there, even though I don't wear makeup too often. Also keep my lotion, um, a few hair products, as well as my Sleepy, which is from Lush. In the cabinet below that, I just keep all of my extra candles as well as my extra hand soap. I promise this is more organized than it looks. I do have several caddies down there. Um, most of them are actually from Target. The only one that's not from Target is the one that holds all of my hot tools, and I believe that one is from Walmart. My shower curtain is from At Home, and both of my rugs are from Target. So in my bathroom is actually my closet. Unfortunately, right now it is a little bit messy, so I'm not gonna show you guys that in this video. And finally, let's move on to the last room in my apartment, which is gonna be my bedroom. So starting off in my room, my desk is actually from Ikea. The chair is also from Ikea, and the rug I have draped over is actually from Home Goods. The little red cup in the corner I think I got from Target a few years ago. Then I just have my blue microphone on top. The mouse pad and mouse are both from Amazon. And then the planner that I do have on top is from Michaels. In the larger drawer of my desk, I just keep a few notebooks, um, an extra hard drive, like a hole punch, tape, just you know, random desk stuff, as well as some business card that I actually bought for myself, I believe about a year ago. 
In the smaller drawer, I actually just keep some extra cords, SD cards, and camera gear, as well as my old planner and a book that I got last Christmas. Between my desk and bookcase, I usually keep um, one of my favorite purses, as well as my camera bag. So on my top shelf, the plant on the left is from Target. The boxes on the right are from Home Goods, and I believe the coin jar is from Rue 21. So the plant is from Target. On the right, the elephant is from At Home, and the frame on the left is from Kirkland's. My two bookends are from Z Gallery, and I believe the candle in the middle that says Dream is from At Home. On this shelf, the Love You is from Hobby Lobby. I usually keep both of my cameras here as well as the owl is also from Hobby Lobby. On this shelf, I just have a black candle that I got from my grandmother and the purple candle is actually a Christmas gift that I got last year. And at the very bottom, I just keep my Crosley player along with all of my vinyls and the bookends on this shelf are from Target. So I thought I would just show you guys my vinyls really quickly. So the first one I have is the Save Rock and Roll album from Fall Out Boy. The next one is Taylor Swift's 1989. I also have this old Stevie Nicks album that I got from one of my friends several years ago when she was moving. The one after that I also got from her as well, which is just the Shunny and Cher Greatest Hit Collection. This one I got from her as well. It is just the original Grease album. And the next two are just from my favorite band. So I do have the Monsters in the Closet album, which is about two albums ago and then their first album, which is A Lesson in Romantics. So unfortunately, I haven't been able to find the bedside tables that I want, but right now I do have two shoe shelves that I got from Target on both sides of my bed. And I do have these Christmas lights as well that I believe I got from Target. And my bed frame is from Rooms To Go. So two of my white pillows are from Home Goods. The other one is from At Home. The pink one is also from At Home and the two in front are from Target. My comforter and blanket are also from Target. On this shoe shelf, I actually keep all of my shoes. To the left of it, I just have the full length mirror that I got from Target. And this rug, I actually got from Walmart. So in my last apartment, I actually had these by the front door, but unfortunately here, I don't have any room for that. So I just have these three mirrors that I got from TJ Maxx above the hook that I got from Target, and I just keep my most frequently used purses as well as my frequently used coats. So yeah, I hope you guys really enjoyed this apartment tour. If you did, definitely make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed already, make sure to do that below as well. And I will see you guys all in tomorrow's video. Bye guys.